If you have data that you need to put into JSON format, here's how to do it. What you need to know is that the data that we're uploading is in key value pairs. So there's a key, which is the name of a variable, and then there's the value, which is the data that you have about a particular facility. So since this is a post request, we go back to the body. And to do this, you start with a curly bracket and then you hit return. When you hit return, it's going to start a new line and you'll see that it's indented, which is what we want. And on this new line, I'll enter the name of a key or a variable that I want, and that's country. And country needs to be in quotation marks, and then there's going to be a semicolon or a colon after it. And then I put the value that I have about the facility that I want to upload. So in this case, it's US, and I put that in quotation marks also, and then I put a comma after that. Then on the next line, I hit enter again, get a new line, and I want to put the next key that I have, and that's going to be name. And then the value for name, again, in quotation marks, um, this is going to be Ben and Jerry's uh, Waterbury factory. And then I'm going to end that line with a comma, press enter and go to the next line. And then I'm going to write address for the name of the, the key or variable that I'm sending. And then um, for address, I'm just going to copy and paste from the data that I have. And again, this is, this is in quotation marks. And this is the last, the last variable that I'm going to enter. So I don't need to put a comma at the end of this line, but I do need to make sure that the, this block ends with a, another curly bracket. And so it's probably already there if you um, were following along with the video, but if it's not there, then just manually type this curly bracket. And so this is the minimum set of uh, of data that I need to upload to OS Hub, country, name, and address. But if there are other key value pairs that I want to upload, like sector or product type or number of workers, I can add those in the same format. Just make sure that the key name is in quotation marks, like address, and then the value is also in quotation marks. And then for any line that's not the last line of this block, make sure that there's a comma in it. And now our data is in correct JSON format.